Hey guys, it's Ian, and I'm going to show you this awesome outfit that I kind of just pulled off the racks from Trade Chic this morning, so bear with me. There are going to be some tags sticking out. It's all available in Trade Chic, and the top specifically is what I wanted to style. That's available at Piona.com, and you can try it on in the store as well. So, to show you from top to bottom, hair, just in like kind of a messy, simple, high ponytail, at least it was high. Might have fallen down a little bit during the day. Anyway, makeup, boring, like usual. And then stud earring, which you've seen a couple times now. This necklace, like, surprisingly goes very well with this shirt, as I'm going to show you, because it has a zipper detail. And I love metal accents, so I'm so excited about this shirt, actually. So, the shirt is this nice satin material. It's a very dark navy blue, which is nice because it's going to go pretty much with anything. I think. And then it has this nice little button, long, longer short sleeve for you there. And so this is my outfit. My entire outfit. Let's make sure I can, make sure you can see my shoes. So I paired the top with this pencil skirt from the U section. It's a size 18W and I want to say it's from Forever 21, but it might be from Target. Anyway, also my tag is sticking out. So, I tucked the shirt into the pencil skirt, wore it very high-waisted. Uh, this is kind of like a, I'm going to go out with, for cocktails with my girlfriends kind of look. So, tight, regular Spanx tights in uh, opaque black, which I love, as you can see. And then for a shoe, I'm wearing a, like a two-inch heel with like a pointed heel on the pointed toe. And so one of my favorite tricks, especially for plus size girls, is to make yourself look a bit longer and leaner, especially because I'm kind of petite in height. So I always pair black on black. So black shoes against black tights. It works a little bit better if it's not a shiny patent heel or if you're wearing like lame or wet looking leggings. But uh, it like creates one long leaner line and that makes you look a little bit taller because it gives the illusion that your leg actually starts from your toe. You can also do that very easily with the nude heel and then not wearing any um, leggings or tights or anything. And by nude, I just mean like uh, a shoe that matches your skin color. And I'm very pale, so mine would be like very pale shoe color. So then for additional jewelry, this ring, I just spit. This ring's available at Trey Cheek. I just threw it on for the video because I kind of felt like I needed like a little extra something. It's six bucks. It's a size 11. If you want to come get it, buy it from us. Anyway, so I want to see what you guys think of this shirt and my outfit actually. Do a little spin for you. You can kind of see the whole thing. Again, I used to wear this only with like skinny jeans, so I tried to dress it up a little bit more. Uh, you could wear this look easily for work if you just paired it with like a nice blazer or if your work's a little more casual, maybe a cardigan and maybe a slightly longer pencil skirt or, you know, don't wear it so high under your boobs. Either way it works. So, as for that, that is my outfit of the day. Everything just kind of like taken from the, around the store. And then my shoes are actually in the used section of Trade Chic, so if you want to come get them, I'll show you them real quick close up. As you can see... Really cute little ankle booty. It has like sort of a stretchy material right here. Uh, these are actually a size 11 with a medium width. And they are Circa, Joan, and David. If you want to come get them. So let me just stand on one heel for a second. And then I wanted to give you a sneak preview of what I'm going to be working on tonight. So we haven't done too many beauty videos yet. And I kind of wanted to do a little bit of that my shoe down and so I wanted to do a nail tutorial not really a tutorial but mostly like a first impression slash like review I guess and we have these little doodads these nail stickers or what do they want to call them nail applique uh, here at the store and I've been looking at these for two years every time I come in to shop or do work or whatever I'm doing I was like oh well they're kind of cute but I don't know I just never bought them. They're five bucks, so I actually just bought them the other day. 
And so I wanted to ask you if you, which one you would prefer me to do. I have stripes and I have like a leopard print. Um, these are both very bold for my nails. I usually wear, if I paint my nails, I usually wear like a gray, which is my favorite color to wear. So tell me what you think. And if I don't get any comments in like the next day or so, then I think I'm just going to end up doing stripes. See, and see how and see if that inspires an outfit too so tell me if you want to see more stuff like this and i will talk to you next time bye guys